some organizations have a long history of 75 years, 50 years, 60 years, 40 years. So all these organizations have a long public standing. They are RSS inspired, but of course they are engaged in work of social transformation. With the democratic setup in democracy, we all of know, we need the such organizations in the public life. They play a very important role. So they always engaged. They are RSS inspired, but they engage like student field, labor field, like Bharatiya Mazdur Sangha, like uh, um, uh, work in tribals, Vanvasi Kalyan Ashram, like some organization working in the field of farmers, like Bharatiya Kisan Sangha. So such organizations, they uh, have chosen specific fields, specific areas, and of course, they are responsible or they take care of that particular section or particular field. And so they are committed for the, that field. So they, over the period, they have studied that field. They are deeply engaged. And of course, uh, in the initial days, they have taken some karikartas from RSS, but over the period, they have developed their own system of developing the karikartas. And so such organizations, uh, of course, every time, every year, once we have such type of formal baitak, and of course, issue-based, some uh, other meetings will also be conducted. And of course, informal coordination is al always goes on. So such is the working style of RSS and uh, coordination system with RSS-inspired organizations.